Hello and welcome to another AARP Texas online discussion where we discuss issues of interest to AARP Texas and its members. I'm Kathy Green, Director of State and Federal Strategy for AARP Texas. And today we are going to talk about some important changes you should know about. These are changes to the Supplemental Nutrition Assistance Program, also known as SNAP or Food Stamp. These these new changes may affect people ages 50 to 54. And with me here today is Jamie Olson, Director of Policy and Advocacy for Feeding Texas. Jamie, it's great to have you with us. Thanks so much, Kathy. I'm happy to be here. So Jamie, let's start with you telling us what Feeding Texas is and why you advocate for that. Yeah, Feeding Texas is the State Association of Food Banks. Uh, we have 21 member food banks that collectively serve all 254 counties in the state. And together we lead a unified effort for a hunger-free Texas. Um, the Feeding Texas Network advocates for SNAP because we know that SNAP is the nation's largest and most effective hunger fighting program. Uh, to give you an idea of scope, for every one meal that our nation's food banks provide, SNAP provides nine. Wow, that's amazing. So it sounds like SNAP's a critical resource for many households facing hunger. Um, let's dive a little deeper into why SNAP is also important to the health of recipients. Yeah, um, this is a really important conversation because folks often don't realize that hunger is at the intersection of many different issues um, and hunger and health are deeply connected. People who are food insecure are disproportionately affected by diet-sensitive chronic disease. 